Okay, positive self-talk, here we go. Hi, self. I really like... You! Okay, pal. You ready to learn how to shave like Dad? First, empty the entire bottle of shaving cream into the sink. All right. Then, throw the razor in the garbage can, because Mommy can't tell me what to do. Ugh, I think I just drank venom. <laughs> I believe you mean poison. Ugh. It's a bit different than venom, and I think it's valuable to know the difference. Ugh. For starters, uh, oh my god. Oh no. He died not knowing he was wrong. Oh god, this is <laughs> it's so embarrassing, but I was 17 when I lost my virginity. How about you? How about me? How about me? Well, wish I didn't have to admit this. <laughs> But I haven't been listening to a goddamn word you've been saying. Hey, sweet place you've got here. Not mine anymore. Oh, right, because you're dead. No, I lost it in the divorce. I just like to haunt this place to drive her nuts. Hey, who wrote butts on the bathroom mirror? Mirror, mirror in my hand. Who be the most badass looking man? You're the most badass looking boy I've ever seen, Brian. Ain't nobody top you, brah! <sighs> Thank you. Okay, gentlemen, to the nightclub. What? You gotta be kidding me. This is the roommate you were talking about? So, I take it you're no longer interested in a threesome? Uh, I mean, maybe. Dad, why did you bring me here? Well, because kind of felt like a good time to teach you about life and death, bud. Oh. You see, this grave belongs to a guy named Mike. Now, Mike bullied me every day back when we were in grade school. And that's something that I could have held on to for the rest of my life. But guess what? A couple years ago, while on vacation with his wife and kids, Mike got into a tragic boating accident, and he died. Oh, yeah, I see. So you finally forgive? So I win. Hey, what's this I hear about your kid telling my kid my dad could beat up your dad? What? He said that? Uh-huh. My stepson called me dad. Oh my god, that is so sweet. Pooch. Pooch. Aw, cute little ghost. Y you think I'm cute? As a button. <laughs> Oh, too much. Mm, last night was incredible. <laughs> really? Yup. All right, for your final interview question, what would you say is your greatest weakness? Okay, I'm going to be honest here. The office candy dish. Can't resist the dish. <laughs> no, I'm looking for character flaws. Well then, I am your man. All right, what seems to be the problem? <sighs> Doc, all my insides hurt. Hmm, I see. Let's get you in for an insidesectomy. I think that should take care of it. Okay. All right, how are we feeling? Actually, I think I was just sad. Uh-uh, little ghost. You are too cute to be in my closet. I know. I just want to watch you and take some scary notes. <sighs> Fine. Just pick something small to haunt that's out of my way, all right? Yes. Moan. <laughs> Moan. <laughs> That was too cute, Lil Ghost! Oh, come on. Zero. One. Zero. Zero. Look, I'm sorry, but I think we should see other people. Okay. What are you... Okay? You're okay with this? <laughs> yeah. Aren't you gonna try to change my mind? No, I think it's a great idea. I can't believe you're breaking up with me. Hey, hey, it's my favorite time of year again. Oh, yeah. Halloween is this weekend. <laughs> every year? You're going to forget my birthday every year. Okay, here's a few ways to tell if you're a little ghost. 
One, if you look at other ghosts, and they're a lot bigger than you, then you're probably a little ghost. Two, if you're trying to be scary, <laughs> this is my least favorite one. If you're trying to be scary, but everyone just thinks it's cute, then you're probably a little ghost. Oh yeah, and then another one is if no one remembers your name, because the only thing they remember about you is that you're Lil, then you're probably a little ghost. Isn't that right, closet ghost Adrian Witowski? Huh? Right? Hey, don't interrupt me when I'm haunting, okay, little ghost? Yeah, I don't think he knows my name. Why do all us ghosts look the same, bro? Hey, don't call me bro. I'm a girl, dude. Well, so am I. <laughs> oh man, they drew all over my face. Was I really that drunk? Ooh, I'm a terrible babysitter. This is stupid. How is looking at a picture of my parents doing it supposed to say something about my emotional functioning? Interesting. So, uh... I miss being outraged. Hmm. What are you doing, little ghost? I'm haunting this family's pumpkin pie. Right. It looks like a kitty stepped in it. Gross. <laughs> they are gonna flip their poop when they see this. Flip their poop. You know what? That's a little too visual when you censor the swear. Ah... The old morning ritual, my favorite robe, a fresh cup of coffee, a bunch of talking to myself out loud with my eyes closed. Yeah. Hey, I'm Lil Ghost and I read every comment. This one from the other day says, Little Ghost will never be scary. Oh yeah? Okay, well... I guess just be careful next time you go to sleep. I may not be good at haunting your house, but I can sure as heck make nightmares of your dreams. Whoa, little ghost. What? My feelings are hurt. Oh, shoot. Wrong glove. Hey, hey, welcome to hell. What? No! Look, I know I wasn't perfect, but I tried my best. I didn't kill anyone. Yeah, I know. Great job. <laughs> So here's your welcome package. You've got cologne, margarita mix, a bottle of tequila, and we got this sweet dating app that's exclusive to hell. It's pretty cool. Oh, enjoy the eternal party, man. Seriously though, like, what are they saying about us up there? Uh, honey? Yeah? I, uh, can't sleep again. Mm-hmm. It's just that I- Hey, you're not gonna die in your sleep tonight. <sighs> Thank you. Hey, kid, enjoy your youth. I swear I just blinked one day and became this old man. <sighs> okay, boomer. What the? Now just what the hell is going on here? See? I knew something was up. Hey, I, I don't want you to think that I asked you out because your dad's rich. It's not about his money at all. He is just so strikingly handsome. Oh, no way! A wizard! What kind of magic do you do? I'm not a wizard, my good man. I'm somebody's weird uncle. Hey, Google, turn off the ceiling fan. Sorry, I don't understand. The fan isn't connected to Google. My life is so goddamn disappointing. 